Yo, what up? I am Run The Track, and today we're going to get into creating a nice piano, smooth, chill, trap, R&B track. So, I have no idea of what I'm going to come up with, but hopefully it's something good. Pull up the keys, get into the NPC doll, let's get into it, right after this intro. Yeah. Run the, run the, run the, run the track up in this, run the track up in this. All right, so here we are already in the MPC DAW. I'm um, going to start working with Alicia's keys today, and I'm just going to lay down a few chords and try to see what I can uh, get into, uh, you know, based on whatever I lay down. So let's get into it. Let me just extend these chords real quick. All right, here was what we got. Now I'm going to change the note mode. I'm going to change the note mode, and uh, I'm going to see what kind of notes that I can play right on top of these chords. And I'm going to stay in the same, um, the same key. So it's on B minor. So I'm going to stay in the same B minor. Continue to play around with this. something let me go ahead and uh, lay this down on top of this and um, I'm gonna split this up later but I will lay this down right now while I have this inspiration gotta work fast sometimes before I lose it So I like the sound of that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take a minute to split this up. This has two parts. It has the note that I was uh, that I just played, and it has the chords that I laid down first. I'm going to separate these so I can have the chords on one track and then the notes on the other track. So let me go ahead and do this, and I'll be right back just so it's easier for me to work with and easier for me to go back and edit if it's in two separate parts. All right, I'm back. So basically what I did was I ended up laying the whole thing down again. Uh, I ended up keeping the chords on the first track as well as the notes. Um, but I turned down the chords a little bit, and then I just layered the chords on the second track. Um, so here's what it all sounds like all together. So I think that's a nice start. We can work with that. Let's continue to move on and push through this track. You know, something kind of chill, nice R&B. Yeah, nice little vibe going on. All right, let's move on. All right, so I got this sound from Arturia Pigments, and uh, it's just kind of an ambient sound, just something to add, just a little bit of flavor to this. So I'm going to go ahead and add that right now. Here's the sound. 
just gonna add like a little background riff and uh yeah let's lay that down We got a nice little start on that. Let me just go ahead and continue to move on. I'm going to try to see if I can add maybe some more elements. All right, so I got Omnisphere loaded up, and actually I have like this weird ambient sound. So it's very, very simple, very, very subtle. I'm going to just lay this down in the background, and I think that's going to be it. I'm going to go ahead and lay down some drums, and uh, yeah, see how that sounds. All right, let me lay this down. since I got kind of this little riff in my mind about some 808s and I already have my key groups loaded so A few moments later Custom sounds down and just a little hi hat. I might not keep the hi hat, but this is more for just for me to keep time. took that sound and I just panned it hard left and right just using the uh, Akai auto pan turned it all the way up
Yo, we interrupt this beat making session for a nice public service announcement. If this is your first time in my channel, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit the like button and right next to it, hit the subscribe button so you can stay up to date with everything that I post. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Let's get back to this beat. Here's what we have so far. little start on this I'm gonna add more uh, just a few more percussion elements just to kind of fill the uh, drum track out a little bit but this track is going to be super super simple let's jump back into the DAW all right I'm gonna add this little kind of um, I'm not even sure what it's called but I call it the magician sound I'm gonna add this just as a slight little different transition <laughs> this um, extra percussion element and I think that's it for the drums maybe a few more melodic elements for when the verse slots happen but uh, yeah this is almost done <laughs> change this sound.
ahead and try to find a sound. I will be right back. Sometimes it takes me a while to find a sound, so I don't want to make you sit through that process. But anyway, give me a second. I'll find a good sound for this because I have the riff laid down. I just need to change the sound to get it exactly how I want it so it fits in well. Be right back. All right, so I finally found the patch that I'm going to use. It actually comes from Electra X. Let me let you hear what that sounds like. <laughs> For this track, uh, I'm going to go ahead and play all the elements and let you hear everything. Now, when I play it, it might sound like it's clashing, but never mind that. I'm going to uh, arrange it and pattern it out to a fully fleshed out song, and uh, it should sound a whole lot better. But these are all the elements that I'm going to use my palette, should I say. the track and you just heard me create that beat now if this is your first time at my channel and you like what you saw you like what you heard go ahead and hit the like button and better yet do me a huge 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 favor hit the subscribe button too so you can stay up to date with all the things that i post for the npc we got beats we got tutorials we got walkthroughs we got uh tips and tricks and everything for the npc whatever one you have if you got the npc x you have the MPC 1, the MPC Live, the Live 2, the Retro Edition. Whatever you got, this can help you. And even some tips and tricks for the MPC Beats DAW, uh, which I know a lot of people have, but they don't even have an MPC. That's cool. Uh, you can get some tips and tricks on how I use the DAW because I primarily work in the DAW, not in the standalone. So, yes, like I said, this is your first time at my channel and you like what you saw, you like what you hear. Go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe button too so you can stay up. Thank you. Now, as for the track, I'm going to go ahead and leave a fully fledged out snippet of it at the end of this. So, make sure you stick around for that. Yeah, make sure you leave comments too. Let me know what you think about this beat. Let me know what you think about this video or anything like that to do with music. If you have any questions for me, any feedback for me, I always appreciate it and I respond to each and every one of my comments. So yes, thank you and I do appreciate it. All right, I am Run The Track. More beats for 2021 and beyond. You know what it is. Win, win, win again. All right. I am running the track. Yes. Track yeah. you.
the track up in the... <laughs>